Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the vlog. I am Shane, of course. We are going to go find something to do today because we literally have nothing to do. I'm just walking around the house right now. Uh, we got to go do laundry later. But um, as of right now, I really have nothing to do other than maybe pick up this trash over here, which uh, I should probably do real quick. So, uh, yeah, let's find a bag and do that. This is ridiculous. All my stuff gets piled over here in the corner all this stuff I got my I need to find a bag um, all my tools and crap over there in the corner and the air compressor and all that uh, here's a trash bag add to this here, here go y'all never seen the inside of my house before which is kind of weird I don't know why I've just never really made a, a video of the inside of my house Need to sweep my floors too. Wow, this is all that junk. So, uh, we'll just uh, do that. So let's go outside and put this uh, stuff in here in the trash. It's Tuesday. So of course the uh, the trash bags are blowing all over hell because it's Tuesday and uh, the trash guy was here and of course he just throws them back in there. But uh, yeah, it's all right. It's nice outside today. It's beautiful. I think it's like oh. I don't know what temperature it is outside, but it's something. Oh, wind noise. Whoops. My bad. Kind of had you cup with my hand. You probably got a lot of wind noise, actually, but there's the old truck. I got to get something done with it. It's setting it rotten out at this point. Well, anyway. Ugh. Van's still clean if you follow me on Instagram. You've seen the pictures I put up the other day after I finally washed it. Um, after I spent 10 bucks washing all the salt off of it, took me a lot of money to do. Let's go over here. I'm just going to show you the inside of my refrigerator. I'm not going to do that because it's not MTV Cribs up in here. It's my, refri my refrigerator is disgusting, so... Not that it's disgusting, like, those dishes are clean, by the way. They're all clean, so no comments. That cup's not, because she just drank milk out of it earlier. That's got sugar in it. That's clean. Those are all clean. And that's a dishwasher, but we don't use it all the time, because it's actually more... Like, if you only have, like, a few dishes, uh, it's a lot easier to wash them by hand than it is if you uh, run the dishwasher. I need to go get a drink, but uh, I don't know what I want to drink. I have Mountain Dew in the van. I guess I could just drink a two-liter Mountain Dew. Sponsor. That'd be nice. Wouldn't that be great? Like a Mountain Dew sponsorship or something? That would be fucking amazing. I, I would love a Mountain Dew sponsorship. That would be ridiculous. A Mountain Dew sponsorship. Uh, not that it'll ever happen. I'd also like to have a, a Monster Energy drink sponsorship too, but you know, we all know that's not going to happen either. So, oh, this town's so dead today. Man. And yes, we do still. No, I don't know why it's still there. I told my girlfriend the other day, I was like, we got to take that down. And she's like, no, I'm going to leave it up. Well, no, you're not. Because I'm going to get rid of it. I told her I was going to take it out in the middle of nowhere and dump it off in a ditch somewhere if she didn't take it down. So there's a slight possibility that that may happen sooner or later. But, uh, 
Yeah. So there's like, I kind of seen the inside of my house walking around there, except my bedroom because it's, the bed's not made or nothing crazy, but yeah, I kind of seen the inside of my house today. Um, yeah. So we are in the van here. Van key. I don't know why it does that. I don't know. Light on oh, it's broke or something. Like this camera is so fuzzy junky. I don't know what's wrong with it. Look at that. See that in there? Can y'all see that? It what the hell is going on, man? Hold on. There's a dog in my yard. I wonder whose dog it is. There was a dog in my yard and I don't have a dog, so I was kind of wondering. I think my camera is broken if I look at it right. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I should switch to my other camera. This is that's crazy. I wonder why it's doing that. I don't, hold on. I'll try to wash it off again. Let's see. Still doing it? No. There we go. Now it's all better. It was just really dirty. Oh, sweet. Awesome. All right. I thought my camera was broke for a second. I don't know what was going on. Hope that dog's not behind me still because I'm going to run it over. I can't see. Back there. This van's ridiculous to back up. There's nothing I like about this. Does not have a backup camera on it. So, it's really. It's got a bunch of blind spots. I don't know whose dog, I don't know whose dog that is. Does anybody know whose dog that is? Looky, it's a doggy. It's a doggy. Anybody know whose dog that is? No, I don't either. I have no idea whose dog that is. But uh, not mine, so. I don't actually have any animals, pets. Because my daughter's mean to them. <laughs> and kids are, the kids are not really good with animals, you know, like. Yeah, I don't know. Leave it in the. Comment below. Oh, can't find my finger. Comment below if y'all have uh, animals. What kind of animals you got? We have weird pets around here. Oh man, I just dinging myself. There we go. We'll stop now. Uh, hold on. We're gonna we're gonna put you down. Hold on. I had to put my seatbelt on so it wouldn't beep. But yeah, so, oh, I did, I forgot to check the tire. The light's not on right now. I went and put air in it this morning, though, because the light was on again, so I don't know. If anybody's wondering what these things are, by the way, I didn't focus on it, but they are air fresheners. Let's see if I can get it right down. There we go. They are air fresheners for the cars, and when you turn the heat on, it makes the van smell good. So I like that kind. Um, so yeah, we're going to get new tires. I've already got them ordered uh, for this couple of weeks. So maybe we'll do a burnout video. Maybe we'll do a burnout video. We'll do a burnout video, so keep up look for that because it's going to be one as soon as I get the caught like as soon as I hear that the tires are in because they said it could take a couple weeks and the only reason why that is is because I wanted to match the one I had which like I don't know if you remember I made a video like a, a well it was around Thanksgiving so it was about three months ago now where um, my girlfriend actually hit 
a big piece of metal in the road in the van and she put a big tire, big old huge hole in the tire, uh, about quarter size hole in the tire. So I had to buy a new tire. Well, at the time they didn't have a set of four and I didn't really think that the other ones were that bad at that time. I mean, now they are because I've done like drive the shit out of it, right? But then like, it's whatever, but. So, uh, he, uh, she said, well, I'll just get another, we just got one tire. Well, I went down to co-op and I, I went down to the co-op and I charged it to my account and they said, oh, well, we got one anyway, so. I said, okay, cool, whatever, you know, don't worry about it, whatever, you got one tire, you got one tire, this is one tire. So we got one tire. Well, then I got, I drove it for three more months, it's been three months ago, and now the, these tires on the front, the one on the back, the other one on the back is still pretty good, but the, one, the two on the front are getting really thin, like really bad. So, uh we need to go ahead and get new ones and I figured since I'm going to go ahead and order two for the front I'm going to have to order I just might as well get the one for the back too and then all four of them will match you know and then it'll have like brand new tires all around and there's no alignment issues with this vehicle on the front or the back so that's her car seat battery by the way um there's no alignment issues with it anywhere, so I'm going to guess that if I put the new tires on it, I should be able to get basically three years out of them at least, right? So I should be able to get three years out of them. Um, you know, that's only about 30, 35,000, 40,000 miles I should be able to get out of the new tires. So I shouldn't have to buy tires for the van until after it's paid off, which will be great because trying to make the payment and buy tires at the same time is a pain in the ass. So, I mean, it's possible because I'm doing it, but because it needs it. And I know I know people give me crap and I, my mom's giving me crap. If, if I showed you guys the tires on here, y'all would give me crap too if you watch this video and see the tires and the condition they're in because they're really bad. <laughs> So, I mean, as far as, you know, bad goes, these are the baldest tires I've ever had on a vehicle before. I mean, the girl, the, the Taurus is bald because we don't drive it a whole lot. Oh, speaking of the Taurus, news for the channel, guys. By the end of March, by the end of March, I don't know... Um, exactly when or where but by the end of March we should have another car on the channel I don't know what yet I haven't really thought about what we're getting um, it's gonna be for the girlfriend though it's gonna be her car because I've kind of taken over the van because she didn't really like to make the payments on it so it was the van was supposed to be hers I don't know if like we bought the van the van was supposed to be hers for, for the kid. And then she decided after we purchased the van that she didn't want to make the payments on the van because it was too expensive. She's the one that wanted the van. She was going to make the payments. And then she decided after she made a couple of payments that she really can't afford to make the payments because of, with her job, it's not as lucrative. You know, it's like she works at the grocery store and she doesn't make that much money. So... And so she decided to herself with the insurance and stuff, it's like $500 a month. And she just decided that she's like, well, I'm not going to make the payments anymore. You take the van, you make the payments and you drive it because you know, and it's a little big for her. And it doesn't really get that amazing to gas mileage either, which is surprisingly enough ridiculous, but it really doesn't get that good a gas mileage, which kindly sucks a little bit I think but I'm okay with it. like the gas bottles that it does get I mean I'm I'm used to driving the Explorer or the truck which gets like single digits most of the time so anything you know 20 or over is just magnificent gas mileage compared to what I usually get so uh, yeah we should do that today we have nothing to do 
We should go cold start the Explorer. It hasn't been started in I don't know how long. Yeah, we'll do that on the end of this video here. Let's go home and do that. Video's at 15 minutes, so we're gonna end it here in a minute, but before we do that, we're gonna go cold start the Explorer that hasn't been running. And, uh, it's, it's been at least, it's been at least four months uh, since I moved it to the spot that it's at now, which was like six months ago. But yeah, let's go, let's go cold start the Explorer and see how that works. I, the battery may even be dead, I don't know. Um, the battery may be dead. <laughs> I don't know. So I will find out. If I if the battery's not dead, I'm pretty impressed because, yes, it is a new battery. I just bought the battery. We just got the battery. Uh, I'm trying to think. When did we get that battery? When did we get that battery? Um, Shit. Um, well, I don't know. Honestly, it's been—it's about a year old in that. I'll have to look on the battery. Actually, I, the, it is a year old. I guarantee it's a year old. So uh, it has got to be a year old. So we definitely have had it for a minute. But it's a six-year battery, so of course it's still going to be good. hair in my mouth anyway sorry um it's a six-year battery so it's going to be of course it's going to have some kind of charge in it but uh maybe not maybe it's completely dead and it's been setting and it's, it's still plugged in so i i honestly don't know if it's going to start or not so it'll be interesting it'll be interesting to figure out if it starts or if it even has gas in it i don't even know what has gas in it do I have my key? Yeah, I have my right keys with me. I'll make sure I grab the right key. I have another key for that. When you have five vehicles, it's hard to have four vehicles now because Jason don't live here anymore. I don't know if I told you all that, but he moved out. He had to go stay with his mom. Um, his mom's really sick, so she's not doing too well, so someone had to go take care of her. But uh, yeah, let's... Uh, Let's see if this thing will go. I don't even know if it'll go. Let's pull up here. I, I don't remember if I unplugged it or not. Let's see. The truck battery, their truck doesn't have a battery in it. I can't cold start it for you guys. It doesn't have a battery in it. Actually, the battery that we use in it is in the Explorer, the one that's in the Explorer. So. Let's go. See if it works. Ooh, it's smelly in here too. Oh my goodness, it's been shut up so long. All this stuff. Oh. Just like that, guys. It has not been started in at least four months. She is a runner. 173,045 miles. And 456 miles since I put oil in it last since I put fuel filled the tank up last I guess no that can't be right um, I don't know oil change required yep that's it she running Fired right up. It's out of gas, though. 
But anyway, guys, we're just going to leave the van sitting out here because we're getting ready to go to work anyway. But um, So I know this video was kind of stupid and didn't have no, no uh, content, but other than to see my pretty face, it's not really that pretty. I uh, hope you all enjoyed it. Um, like I said, the, there will be like some stuff coming. I know that there's going to be, I know I'm at least going to do the burnout in the van. I know that because that's definitely happening. Um, it's not going to be a very big one, however, because, well, the, the tires are garbage. So I'm not going to be able to, unless I take it to the tire shop and do the burnout in it. And then have them change it, which I don't know that they're going to let me do that. So <laughs> I think it'd be kind of fun, but I don't think they're going to let me do that. So, um, but yeah, we we're going to definitely be doing some sort of video for that to get the new because we're we are definitely getting new tires. So that'll be something we'll do, and then we're also going to be getting the new vehicle in a couple of months. So stay tuned for that if you want to. Check out yet another car. Hit the subscribe button down below. Um, trying to get to a thousand subscribers before February twenty third, so I don't lose my monetization. But that's not going to happen. Which I really don't care about that either, because I don't make any money off of it. Never have, never got it paid. So if uh, this video makes a million views and I make twenty bucks off of it, I'll be happy. So it's not going to. It'll get like three views. But anyway, down below. It goes, or all the questions, comments, concerns, anything you got to say, hit me a message or hit it down below and I'll answer you as well as I can. So, well, it'll come to my phone, so I'll answer you as soon as you do it. But uh, down below, follow me on Instagram. It'll be in the description. I do post a lot of pictures to Instagram, most of them food and car related. And, uh... I guess I will see y'all next time. I'm going to go find me something to eat and get ready to go to work. So, hope y'all enjoyed your day. I'm going to upload this video real quick. And then I will see you all next time here on the channel. Peace out, guys.